think that men do want less of relationships, even when they're with one person. Let's say a, a man is married. I personally believe that a man is only as faithful as the amount of options that he has. So, if he's married but he still has a lot of options, he still wants those lustful relationships. He may not be able to be with all of them legally. Broadway, don't do me like that. <laughs> Thank you for that don't one. Don't do me like that, Broadway. Hey, hey, no, hold on, so I want to answer a question. Hold on, bro. Wait, two seconds. I feel like you could walk and chew gum at the same time. Y'all niggas don't know how to multitask. That's a fact. Niggas don't know how to multitask. Alexis said something. God damn it, I don't forgot my thought. Oh, that's what Alexis said. A man is only as faithful as his options. That's bullshit. Because I'm a faithful motherfucker. And you know what? I got a lot of options. Back. What are you talking about? What are we talking about? Because a nigga got options, but I'll be a faithful nigga. You get what I'm saying? So I don't Keep believe that. that. Same I think there's energy. certain things in narrative. Let me come closer to the mic. I feel like there's certain things in narrative that's put out there and people just, you know, it's like a it's like a fishing rod. You throw it out there and different people attach themselves to it and they start ringing people in. That's bullshit. <laughs> niggas be out here and be niggas be out here and being faithful. It just be the age-old thing that I've been saying since the beginning of this podcast. You be having good niggas that be with bad bitches, and the bad bitches be fucking it up for the other good bitches because now about time the good nigga get to the get to the, the good bitch, respectfully, by the time the good nigga get to the good bitch, now he's all tainted because he had nothing but bad bitches to draw from. So you saying... It's a whole bunch of goofies out here. A, that's whole, what it a whole lot of goofies out here. Hello. And if you're a goofy, it's okay. But just know what you are and, 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 and live on that. Die on that rock. And also, when you meet somebody, just say, yo, I'm goofy. And if they accept you for who you are, then it's cool. It's not, it's not ever cheating when somebody knows that you're going out and you're stepping out, right? It's only cheating when you conceal your intent. That's the only time it's misleading, manipulative, when we call it narcissism. Narcissism, that's the only time that it's those things. You talking to a nigga that's been outside. Yes, sir. <laughs> so when, when when you talking when you talking to somebody like this you 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 can't sell me you can't sell water to a well you can't sell me bullshit and tell me what you want it to be you get what I'm saying so I be seeing shit and I be knowing that yo niggas be wanting lustful situationships niggas don't really want relationships niggas don't really want relationships click Live on I am underscore Broadway's Instagram. Clear. <laughs>